Uh, Sheikh, I'm a revert from Hinduism to Islam and I find my parents imposing of their beliefs on me. Although they have allowed me to practice my religion, they force me to engage in acts like wishing for birthdays, shaving my beard, and there are also idols in my house. All of this affects my faith, so I want to know how to strengthen my faith and stay convicted to it. Jazakallah khairan. Well, Jazak. First of all, it's a blessing that they are allowing you to practice your religion and then not facing you with hatred and enmity and oppression like the vast majority of uh, uh, such a faith followers who have huge hate towards Islam. Welcome to the club. But when it push comes to shove and you are at a fork of a road, whatever endangers your Islam has to be eliminated. Nothing can be compromised when there is a risk or a threat to your own belief and conviction. So if you feel that you're being negatively affected by their pressuring, by their rhetoric, and imposing their beliefs on you, you have to bail out. You have to run. Pack your bags and go. Especially if you're an adult and you're financially independent, you could work anywhere. Go to another country, to another city, and relocate so that you can keep your distance, practice your religion, and remain steadfast on it. Meanwhile, you have to, either when you stay with them or when you leave, you have to surround yourself with righteous practicing Muslims 24 hours, seven days a week. You have to hang out with them. You have to attend the congregation prayer with them. You have to go to lectures if they have any lectures and the likes so that you would cement Iman in your heart and not allow this to happen and Allah knows best.